It's a shame we have to spec four-wheel drive and a superb 740D. The engine is pure class, and makes the big limousine accelerate like a sports car. However, for most British buyers, the extra cost will outweigh any advantage of all-wheel drive. The lesser powered but still excellent 730D remains our top pick, then, with almost as much get up and go, but for thousands less, we praised it for its beautifully crafted cabin and space age technology, as well as its first class refinement and powerful diesel engines. But that wasn't all, the new BMW 7 series is not only cheaper to buy than the equivalent S class, however, this is the first time we've been given the chance to try BMW's flagship saloon with the brand's more powerful diesel engine. It's available to order now, exclusively with X-Drive all-wheel drive. BMW has cleverly backed its buyers into a corner, though. You can buy less potent 730D with or without all-wheel drive, but you can only buy a 730D X-Drive with a standard wheelbase. The 740D, however, is available with a long or a short wheelbase. You can however, specify X-Drive on both the standard wheelbase 730D and the 740D, and it's the more powerful car we tried here, albeit in long wheelbase form. Confused? It's not surprising. The steering has the same two settings, but the 7 Series is a bit short on feel through the wheel. While comfort mode is perfect for motorway jaunts, as we drove up through the mountains around Geneva we were left wanting more. Still, for 10 months of the year, most UK buyers will never need the all-wheel drive system. While it's hard to compare prices like for like, looking further down the range at the 730D suggests you pay around £2,700 for the privilege of two added driven wheels. In fact, while the 740L does superior power and to more car a welcome addition, the 730D more than serves its purpose and feels suitably rapid in gear, especially from 50 to 70 miles per hour. Fuel economy understandably takes a small hit, too. The 7 Series is still remarkably efficient for such a gigantic limousine, though, with even this 316 bhp, long wheelbase 4x4 